Welcome back, investigators. Do you have your character role sheets? Today, we shall be developing your character's roles, drives, and actions. A character's role is made up of three drives. Nerve, cunning, and intuition. And each drive is made up of three actions. Got it? The drive nerve has the actions move, strike, and control. The drive cunning has the actions sway, read, and hide. The drive intuition has the actions survey, focus, and sense. You will use these actions to solve mysteries and overcome obstacles and challenges. Each action will have a rating from 0 to 3, which are how many dice you can roll while taking that action. Each drive will have 0 to 9 points. You will be able to spend available drive points to add more dice to your roll while doing an action that is part of that drive. This is called your dice pool. Shopkeeper. Look at your character roll sheet. Notice the slink roll with the criminal speciality already has five action points circled. One control, two hide, one survey, and one focus. Captain? Look at your character roll sheet. Notice the weird roll with the occultist specialty already has five action points circled, one control, one read, one focus, and two sense. Now choose one action with a zero rating and increase it to one. You now have three more points to spend, but no action can have more than two. Now, look at the drives on your character roll sheets. Do you see how the shopkeeper's slink criminal has one drive point in nerve and two in cunning, while Captain's weird occultist has all three in intuition? Use a pencil to fill in the rectangles above those boxes. You now have six more drive points to spend any way you want, but no drive can have more than six to start. 
After you have chosen your six drive points to add, fill in the bottom square with pen. And with pencil, fill in the rectangles above them. Now, we need to add resistances. Do you have any drives that have three or six boxes filled? Fantastic! Shopkeeper, you fill in with pencil two triangles of resistance under cunning. You get one resistance for every three drive points marked. Captain, fill in two triangles of resistance under intuition. Shopkeeper. Captain, you are almost done. Do you see the diamond on the left of each of your actions? Shopkeeper, your slink criminal has hide filled in. Captain, your weird occultist has the focus diamond filled in. They are your gilded dice actions. They help you recover spent drive. Fill in one more diamond next to an action where you might need to regain your spent drive points. Okay then. Now look in the middle of your page. Captain, do you see Roll Weird? Shopkeeper, do you see Roll slink. Read your three abilities and choose one for your character. Captain, do the same for your specialty occultist. Shopkeeper, do the same for your specialty criminal. Be sure to fill in the diamond next to your choice. The last thing we will choose is a circle ability on the back page. Which circle ability do you want to start with? Excellent! You are doing well. For the next video, we will add your backstory, relationships, and gear. Then, it will be time to play! <laughs>